How to clean drywall dust. Drywall is used to form the inside walls of buildings and houses. It requires sanding, which results in a large amount of dust. Demolition of old drywall also generates a considerable amount. Drywall dust is very fine and pervasive, with a consistency close to powder. Because of this, it can quickly and easily spread throughout your home. You'll need to be vigilant to prevent this, starting with preventative measures before the job begins. Preparing the area. Lock off all vents and openings with plastic sheeting. Heavy-duty plastic sheeting helps to minimize how much dust gets dispersed through the air. Cover all the openings throughout your home, such as doorways and windows, with it. For best results, hang the sheeting from floor to ceiling. Cover all of the air vents and ductwork. Secure the plastic sheeting with masking tape. Cover the floor and protect the furniture. Move as much furniture out of the way as you can. Cover what can't be moved with plastic sheeting, especially upholstered furniture, since the dust can work itself into the fabric. Secure the sheeting in place with bungee cords. Place plastic sheeting over the entire floor of your work area. If you have carpet in the rest of the house, consider covering the floors in every room with self-adhesive plastic lining. Turn off the central heat and air circulation. Leaving the system on will result in drywall dust getting into it, which will then spread throughout your home. Even though you're covering all of the air ducts with plastic sheeting before you begin, it is still beneficial to turn off the circulation system. Be sure to leave the circulation system off until you've completed your task and cleaned up the dust afterward. Check your system's air filter frequently in the weeks following the sanding. You will probably need to replace it soon after. Place box fans in the windows. Using box fans will help keep the room you are working in ventilated. Open the windows and place the box fans in them. Be sure to position the box fans so that air blows out of the room, not into it. Use plastic sheeting to seal off the area around the fans and window frames. Duct tape the plastic in place. If any of the windows have air conditioning units in them, remove them from the room. They get clogged with dust easily. Use the box fans on a low setting, which will cause the least air disturbance. Setting them on high will suck out a lot of the dust, but it will also increase the amount that's moving through the air. Remove the door and window screens. This will allow the dust to move freely from inside to outside. It also improves the air circulation in the area. Not removing the screens will trap a lot of the dust in the room. You will also have to remove drywall dust from the screens after you've finished sanding.